Alright, it's time for me to react to it right about now, so let's get started. So this time I'm going to react to, <clears throat> my bad, um, Haunted California Hotel and Casino by a good favorite of mine, um, Paracera. And apparently, um, I think I remember the last time I reacted to is, um, I don't remember, but I do remember was, I guessing, the hundred, the hundred clown motel. Am I correct? Cause um, cause once again, I did not know that one of those clown motels exists, and I thought about it sometimes, but. It, it, it's really scary, man. It's really scary. But, except for one thing that I'm not scared of clowns, was Scary Giggles. I miss Scary Giggle that much because, um, I haven't, like, hear or seen her post for quite some time. I don't know. But y'all let me know, comment down below. Is she still around? Because, um, maybe... Maybe she only shows up only for um, October, I guess. But um, but we'll, we'll 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 see, we'll see. But I believe this happened in Las Vegas, I think. But I don't know. Y'all let me know. Comment down below, and we're gonna get started in five, four, three, two. What's your name? What? What's up guys, today I'm checking out the California Hotel and Casino. Let's go find out if this place is haunted. Okay. Okay, that's interesting. Got a stick figure here. Wow. Okay guys, I'm probably gonna get kicked out of here pretty soon. I had one security guard who was already like super rude to me, so, but I really wanted to get a spirit box session in here before I leave because there was a stick figure right here. So I'm gonna try to get the spirit box session in before I get kicked out. Are there any spirits in here? like this game? Are you stuck here? Something in Spanish. You like this game? Is this room haunted? Okay. Are there any children in here? What's your name? 
Jack. Nice to meet you, Jack. How old are you, Jack? You're young, huh? Young forever, right? You're old? I'm very freaked out, man. Jack, I'm, are you a minor? I'm trying, I'm trying to figure out what the hell it is. Um, are you a gambler? You just said I'm a gambler. What's your favorite game? What do you play? I feel like it's hard to say something. Do you like blackjack? You like Texas Hold'em? Who plays Texas Hold'em? You play cards? figure. I wonder if that's Jack. It's like right on the table. Are you trying to play air hockey? 
That's it for today, guys. Stay tuned for the next video in my Ghosttober series. Be sure to subscribe and notify. And until next time, happy haunting. Jesus Christ, man. Um, like, I, I'm, I'm trying to figure out what the hell is going on around here, but sometimes it's very hard to, like, communicate with the, the ghostly things, but, um, but it's trying to, like, communicate something, like a hint or something, like, so there's, <laughs> uh, okay, so there's Spanish, um, there's Spanish, um, let's see, I like it, I believe, I, I believe, um, he likes the, the games or some. I don't know, but let's, let's see, let's find it, it says no, it says no, um, Gabby, or this Gabby, so, oh yeah, uh, and sometimes it keeps making some weird sounds because that's why there are crescent, crescent marks here. So yeah, it's very, it's very hard to communicate. But there's sort of some residue, but it's probably like leave something like a hint, hint like a hint or something in order to like figure out of these um. I don't know, man, but, um, but yeah, man, I always like, you know, once again, I always like going to arcades, but sometimes it could be a little, it could be something that's been going on, like some place is haunted or whatever, but, um, <laughs> the same things that, the same thing I react to, um, oh yeah, Brittany Crabs. When the same things, you know, from the handball, of course, and um, sometimes it's very hard to communicate with um, like I said, it's very hard to communicate with the ghost type of that. Um, you know, I'll try to get his name, if this place haunted, you know, figure something out and stuff, and you know, that's how it is, man. But also, oh my god, I hate to say this, but um, maybe I need to maybe I need to do this uh, my own paranormal activity stuff because even though I'm gonna try, I'm gonna need five or ten of one of my groups because um, I don't want to I don't want to do this alone. Cause if I do this alone, then I, I, I just can't. Cause that's not how I want to do it. You know, call me a scary cat, or however you want to want, how you want to call it. Because I'm just feel like I need something like it on well, my first time experience about this, and um, it's it's very hard, man. It's very hard to communicate for you know. Oh, sorry. It's very hard to, like, go out into the bandit, somewhere in bandit, or somewhere that places hot and hot, you know, around the cities or woods or elsewhere. I, I don't know, man, but, um, yeah. But I'm really scared about it, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna see what I can do, but, um, and um, <laughs> I I don't know, man. I might be a coward because yeah, I am I don't want that to happen to me. So yeah, <clears throat> but yeah, man. So if y'all want more of the scary videos and um some scary stories, like I said, I'm gonna do this all day, every day, including the weekends as well. Cause we're gonna go by day by day until um, Halloween. That's my plan to do so. So yeah, and um, 
hopefully uh hopefully we'll see more of para uh, paracera and um hopefully we're going to see some more of uh, some scary stuff itself out I, I was going to react to um horror um short films but I'm throwing the towels I just can't do it cuz I know it's going to be too scary so I know I'm going to be I, I'm not going to be act like um BAC you know blasphemous agency Shout out to him, man. He's he's funny as hell, man. I ain't gonna lie, man. But um, but yeah, um, but yeah. So I think that's gonna be it for today. Sorry, but don't worry. I will try my best to do some more of these videos if I can, along with um scary games or whatever. Cause yeah, um. <laughs> also, by the way. It actually reminds me of a dead a uh, dead at night, I believe. A dead at night? Am I correct? I think so. Hold on. Okay, a dead at night. Cause um, <clears throat> I remember some of the parts of, you know, something, you know, trying to communicate with the spirit. And, um, I think it might be, like, some emotional stories that would happen when they pass away from, like, years and years ago of how it happened. So, yeah. <clears throat> so, that's what, that's what that one reminds me of at, at Dead of Night, because, um, um, I gotta say, man, it's very interesting, though, seeing it. But, um, but yeah, so... I think that's gonna be it for today. Uh, make sure you like, comment, subscribe if you're here. Click the bell notification down below, and I will see y'all tomorrow once again. And yeah, this is Kyle signing off. Bye.